How's it going everyone and welcome back to the next episode of Spider-Man Remastered. I kind of messed up. The OBS did not record any of my mic inputs. So for these last gameplay sessions of Spider-Man, there is just absolutely no commentary. However, I don't want to just cut it short there because this shit has been going on for too long and it'd be too much of a shame to just like end it here like a like a like a wet part so anyways i'm gonna try and cobble something together maybe put some post narration with this cute little mic over here i hope you enjoy whatever the final product is i don't know what it's like yet i'm praying for dear god anyway enjoy the trouble thanks pete wish me luck and wish me luck okay. too because my mic got fucked up in this video and i have to redo it there's the security room but that guard will see me if i go in so I have to distract him. Upset. What if I do a little boogie? Maybe a little distraction dance. Wag my finger. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. Or I could just spread misinformation. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. Get out here right now! Security the room's open. Just need to and get ladies and gentlemen, just like that, with the power of Tom Foolery, we've made it in. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Hello. Bye bye. I'm gonna tickle you. Good boy. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Don't mind me. Find the alarm technique. I'm just trespassing. Stupid useless button. You fucking bitch. Let me go. Move. Move. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Yeah, that's right. Your two terabyte homework folder. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. This mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? Hmm. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza. No, it's not. It's about the Mets, baby. Let's go Mets. Drinks. Let's get another home run. Love the Mets. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. And there you have it, folks. Spider-Man 2. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. So obviously this is the part where I read a bunch of the text here, but my mic didn't pick it up and I'm not reading this shit again, so I'm gonna move on to the next clip. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We you are staying here! The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the Labitat now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. And we're back for more carnage, baby. Take this shit. Now, I don't know what possessed me to not beeline straight to the objective, but I guess I just wanted blood here. Wait. Oh my god, bro, man, what the fuck? Okay, July 18. Bingo. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Devil's Breath Lab must have a GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. G 
GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Oh no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's so gross, bro. I would have pissed my fucking pants if I was there. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Control. Status. Nothing to report. Yeah! Hey! <gasps> Boss, we got her. No! Pete, you here? Turn it off, Lex, now. Are you okay? We'll be in a few seconds. Northwest corner. Hey, you ready? Wait, wait, hold on. It's too late. You're up. You are crazy. You're amazing. So much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. And with that, we're one step closer to the ending of the game. But like I said before, the mic recording also fucked for that one, so I'm just gonna condense the two episodes here, just like that. And welcome back to the next part of Spider-Man, in the same video. Again, I apologize for all the technical difficulties when it comes to this final episode. It sucks that it had to be the final episode, but you know, at least there's still something around here. But anyways, I hope you enjoy. While I kick these motherfuckers asses. Oh my god. Open it. Have 
to take care of these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to Allow me to employ snipers. some peaceful conflict resolution. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I, I think we can uh, just talk about this like adults and deal with it in a simple manner. If you don't mind. Spider-Man, leave now. Okay. Why are you so heavy? <sighs> You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. Alright guys, seems you did it. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Oh my god, she's bad as fuck. Holy mo- No way to go but down. Turn back, Spider-Man. This is between me and Osborne. I know about the accident. I know what happened to your parents. The accident? You sound as clinical as Osborne. My parents died because of me. Because of what Osborne did to me. You're more than your past. Don't let it control you. I tried so hard to make my parents proud. To honor their legacy. But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice! I won't let you do this, Martin! Lee's pain... His anger... It's fueling his power. I'm sorry. It was an accident. I was trying to help. You don't help people. You use them. This won't bring your parents back. Why do you insist? I'm trying to save this piece of scum! I'm trying to save you, Martin! Don't let revenge win. Fight it! Alright, one long ass cutscene later and now we're gonna kick his ass. I'll never stop! I'm so glad this guy's in full white attire. That means I can always see him on my screen. So I know exactly where to fuck him up. Just like that. Yeah! Fight back. Fight back. Oh my god, he got thunder breathing. My brother is pulling out the thunderclap and flash. No. And now we think he Iron Man. Why oh, you put your arm out like that? Exactly who I am. Don't do it, bro. What the fuck are you spinning for, bro? Look at Beyblade. No more. Well, Mr. Negative, it seems I have the upper hand on you. I can read all of your moves. Spin one more time. I will single-handedly dodge all of your moves that you throw at me. Fight it, 
it, Martin! You can walk away! No! Osborne must suffer! <laughs> Alright, ass kicking round two. Electric Boogaloo. Damn, this fight looked kind of cool though. I mean, he eyed though. Hit him with a disrespect first. And smack his face. Can't give up. He's almost down. What the fuck? Where did brother come from? I think I may have forgotten what to do around here because uh, honestly, I'd just be running around and shit. Bro. Holy shit, Spider-Man is so fucking cool. Osborne needs to pay. I know. But this is the wrong way, Martin. Useless. Look on your face. You can't imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? Gone. I would not worry about him right now. He needs a hospital. No. No hospital. Feast. I need to speak to your head doctor. Uh, there's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, All whatever right. you have that's sterile. Thank you. You can thank me by not dying. Oh my god.
He'll live. But he needs rest. They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti-serum. I don't know if I can beat him. Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. Fuck yeah, she said the line, she said the thingy thing. That's our girl. Sorry for the lack of commentary. I think in the, even in the original recording, I wasn't really saying much. I figured I'd just let the cutscenes play out just uh, as they would. I think the drama should just unfold and speak for itself. All right. No. No, that's not it. Maybe it's this one. No. And that is Spider-Man Miles Morales. Which I will not be playing because goddammit, Lord knows I do not have the time for that. And Spider-Man 2 is already out. And hopefully this video is out on the same MJ's day. MJ's right. I built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. There must be something at the lab I can use. Spider-Man. Hello. Man, I gotta change this number. I must leave New York. Recent events give me pause. Your rescue of Osborne, despite his hatred, it affected me. I must return home, reflect on this life I choose. Dang, I think I'm actually gonna miss you and your death troopers. Unfortunately, my agents will stay. Though I question our work, they do not. And Osborne continues to pay. I am sorry. So close to being good news. Indeed. I will miss you and your bizarre witticism, Spider-Man. Until we meet again. What a strange, violent lady. Yeah, but she's still bad as fuck. We did the impossible, Doc. But now I have to destroy it. With a little creation of my own. the truth before they mop you off the pavement. Oh! Oh! Tell them what you did. I 
never! Everything you have is built on lies! Lies! You stole my company! My ideas! Now! The truth. The truth. Okay. The truth is, you were only ever worth a damn when you worked for me. The truth is, you could never accept that I'm better than you. You're a failure, Otto, and you always will be. <laughs> Otto, you've worked your whole life to help people. Please. You're fighting the wrong man. But I have it your way. Okay, it's about to get very dramatic, so apologies for the lack of commentary already. It's just been cutscene after cutscene, and I'm gonna... I gotta take this dude down. You've already done enough yes, to ruin now that I have his tentacles covered in my white stuff, I can take him down. God damn, this guy wakes up extra early just so he has more time to hate. Gotta move. Gotta hit him with the disrespect first, though. Hey! Give me the anti serum, and I promise Osborne will face charges. Liar! Just like more white stuff, more white stuff, put more white stuff on his tentacles. These finishers are so cool. Enough of this! Oh, he's doing it again. How many times do we have to do this, old man? You knew? I tried to warn you, Peter, but you didn't listen. You knew? I won't let you win. This means too much to me. Not more than it means to me! Now for the real fight. 1v1, final destination, Fox. Yes, it's a ruin. Can't you see all the people you're hurting? You'll never understand. You haven't suffered like I have. You should be on my side. I won. Please, think of the man you were! 
That man is gone. You can't save me, Peter. Then I guess you'll have to save yourself! You were my hero! You meant so much to me! I hate that you're making me do this! We're going to change the world! You look tired, Parker. Not tired. Just hurt. If you want to change the world, you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions. <gasps> I couldn't agree more! Holy shit, man. I don't even have anything to say. I, well, like, I don't have a joke, man. The voice acting is just so good in this game. <coughs> Peter, I saw you as a son. I should have known you'd turn on me, just like all the others. Turn? Turn? I've worshipped you, your mind, your conscience, wanting to help others, the way you never gave up. That's because men like us have a duty, a responsibility, to use our talents in the service of others. Even if they don't appreciate it, we have to do what's best for those beneath us, whether they understand it or not. No, you're wrong! You are everything I wanted to be! You just threw it away! Yes, of course. You're right, Peter. Oh, I see that now. The neural interface affected my mind. But I can fix it. We can fix it together. If you'll help me. Do everything I can. I'll make sure you get the best help. No! If they put me away, they'll take my arms! I'll be trapped in this useless body! Please, Peter. That wasn't me. You said you'd never abandon me. You promised. Remember? And of course, you rest easy, knowing your secret is safe with me. You do what you think is best, Doc. It's all any of us can. Peter? Even when it hurts like hell. Peter, where are you going? Peter?
still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? Then there won't be enough to cure the others. I'll give you a few minutes. gonna be okay ma'am i've got the cure right here take off your mask i want to see my nephew you knew i've known for a while i never wanted you to worry i did and i am so proud of you and Ben would be too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. So? Hi. Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. <laughs> Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but, uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's... You're a scientist. A good one. Yeah, the last project I worked on, I created a monster octopus that almost destroyed the city, so... Yeah. I mean, you do make a hell of a chicken curry. <laughs> I do. Still working on my dumplings, though. Going camping? Oh, uh, my uh, new place isn't going to be ready for about a week, so I'm going to be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. 
You know, you can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I mean, I mean, I mean, yes. I mean, no, no. I don't. I not want to. But meaning, I, I, I do want to. But only if you do. I never stopped wanting to. Me neither. Yeah, baby, let's go. That's my boy. Straight off the bat, I just want to say I know that was uh, a lot of cutscenes with little to no commentary. But honestly, in the original recording, I wasn't really saying much either, just letting the story play out. And if you stuck around this far, I just want to say thank you, and that I think you real as fuck for that. And of course, this isn't a story without a post credit scene, so I'll let that roll, because I can't be bothered to extend this video any longer by keeping the credits here. Well, I'm not an expert or anything, but I think it's in the way that you ask her. I'm getting too nervous. <laughs> hey, alright, so where do you want this? Uh, right over here is fine. Alright. Hey, so Pete? Yeah. I, uh, kinda gotta talk to you about something I can't tell my mom about. What's up? Well, um... Weird things have been going on. Like, physically. Oh. Oh, uh, well, you know, you're at that age where, where your, your body starts to change. And so you may be noticing some areas, no, for example. Not that. Uh, I think it's, I think it's better that I just, um, I show you. I show no, you. No, 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 no. It's pretty weird, right? Not that weird. And this has been Spider-Man Remastered. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this series. And as always, please, have yourselves a damn good one.